rather than face the potentially awkward spectacle of an all-male Republican contingent questioning Ford, Judiciary Committee Chairman Chuck Grassley, R. Iowa, will turn over the questioning to a woman, a sex crimes prosecutor he refused to name in advance. We have hired a female assistant to go on staff and to ask these questions in a respectful and professional way, Majority Leader Mitch McConnell told reporters. Grassley told Politico earlier Tuesday that Republicans were not releasing the name of the questioner out of concern for her safety. He said it was undecided whether his party would reveal the identity of the prosecutor before the hearing. In a letter to Grassley on Monday, Ford lawyer Michael Bromwich took issue with the plan for a prosecutor, not the Republicans on the committee, to question his client. The Democrats, including the four female senators from the party on the Judiciary Committee, will question Ford and Kavanaugh regarding the allegations. Kavanaugh has denied any sexual improprieties in his past, and in an interview on Fox News on Monday he asserted that he had been a virgin into his 20s. Democrats blasted the decision to schedule a Friday vote even though the Judiciary Committee had not yet heard from Ford. Republicans don't even need to hear her before they move ahead with a vote, Senator Dianne Feinstein, D. California, told reporters. It's clear to me that Republicans don't want this to be a fair process. Grassley, however, said that scheduling the vote was not a guarantee that it would actually take place on Friday.